Hey, this is Pastor Frank, and today I'm with my buddy Sheriff. Sheriff is a wonderful little mutt that is at the office that I do this filming at every week. And Sheriff is an expert in prophecy in the eighth chapter of Daniel. And so he just wanted you guys to know that it's all true. God is true. That's why Daniel 8 was written. Well said, Sheriff. Thank you so much for sharing with us that today. That's very important. Sheriff had to go, but uh, he did want to say that again. Daniel chapter 8 is an amazing chapter. Pastor Frank, coming with you from last week's message. And uh, last week we talked about the 8th chapter of Daniel. Uh, an amazing piece of scripture in which the prophecies that God spoke to the prophet Daniel uh, all have come true by the time you and I are speaking of it. It's an incredible chapter, and when people look at it, they just kind of shake their heads, like, how, how can this be so? Um, good stuff. And, and, you know, honestly, I just got a lot of feedback, too, from just sharing uh, about our friend Tina and when she came out of the hospital and she just wrote on that piece of paper, it's real, that she, she described heaven, she described Jesus. People, what we believe is not something that we just created in our minds. God is real and God exists. And uh, the more we drive that in, I think, it just builds such a sense of peace and confidence in our lives that this foundation of our Creator is just so cool. Hey, this, this next week we're going to be entering the ninth chapter of Daniel. Read ahead if you'd like to. Uh, an amazing piece of scripture as well about um, prophecies about the end, as always, visions of the future. Hey, uh, next week we're going to be finishing at Woodbridge as well. Uh, we're in our third week of our discipleship series. We want to encourage you to come be a part of that. And um, that's about it. Woodbridge, God bless you guys. Uh, sit, be kind to a little white dog this week if you can find one. They're very cool and special. And uh, the Lord bless you and keep you and watch over you. We will see you on Sunday. Take care. Bye-bye.